One of the most shocking aspects of the child labor scandal involving Packers Sanitation Services Incorporated PSSI, is that the children were not being given proper safety equipment to protect them from the hazards of working in a slaughterhouse. According to the Department of Labor Dole, the children were exposed to dangerous chemicals, sharp knives, and bloody machinery that could cause serious injuries or infections. The Dole released photos that show some of the children wearing protective glasses and gloves, but not much else. They were holding buckets and spraying down equipment with hoses. Some of them had chemical burns on their hands and knees. One of them even fell asleep in class after working a night shift at a Nebraska plant. The Dole said that PSSI violated federal child labor laws by employing at least 100 and two children between the ages of 13 and 17 across 13 meatpacking plants in eight states. The children were working overnight shifts, sometimes up to six days a week, cleaning and sanitizing equipment used to cut and process meat. The Dole fined PSSI $1.5 million for the violations, which amounts to $15,138 per child. The Dole also said that PSSI failed to provide adequate training and supervision for the children, who were often recruited by their relatives or friends who worked for the company. Some of the children told investigators that they did not receive any orientation or instruction on how to use the chemicals or equipment safely. They also said that they did not have access to first aid kits or emergency showers in case of accidents. The Dole described the conditions that the children faced as harrowing and appalling.